what's up guys this is Zenon over here and in today's video I'm going to show you guys out a new browser known as Opera Neon what I really like about this browser is its fascinating features which have really impressed me so let's get into some of its pros and later we will get into some of its cons and we will get into some of its feature also now what you get, the first feature that I'm gonna show you guys out is the gravities and these type of things like you can see the gravity the physics the transitions we can say of this browser are really amazing which I love when you just make like minimize a tab and open it and the new alignment of tags and stuff uh, uh, tabs and stuff like that are really amazing now let's get into a feature of it which I really love it so uh, the one feature that I really love about this browser is also in Opera not only in Opera Neon what it does is that when I play some sort of music and I'm surfing a different web page it sort of gives me a uh, option to pause it from right here and play it whenever I want so that's a pretty amazing and handy feature and in the cases of YouTube videos when we are playing it like this uh, what, and I'm browsing any other then it will display a short icon like this and you can just pin it upwards right here and now you can enjoy this video and music or whatever the video you're watching and the browser the window you are using at the same time like if you are doing like browsing through your Twitter or Facebook feed you can see a video and do pretty much other stuff at the same time which is a pretty fascinating fascinating feature I'm gonna uh, close this so uh, let's get some further now the next feature that I'm gonna show you is the snapshot feature uh, snapshot feature now you can click on this camera button and crop to snapshot anything for example this laptop after snapshotting it this will get saved to this right here now what you can do is drag it onto any other messenger stuff and you can uh, press enter and uh, send that message now for example uh, if I want to send anything like I want to send a snapshot of something I'm guiding someone to do something on website I just snapshot and send it to just by simply dragging here now this next thing that I'm gonna show you guys so here I have opened another website to demonstrate this now I will left click hold and drag this right here and I will uh, drag this to show in left view and it will show this the New York Times website and my website that I was before at the same time which is a pretty fascinating feature for multitasking like messaging and browsing things browsing your YouTube uploading a YouTube videos setting it at the same time which is pretty amazing feature at the same time you can guide them and take snapshot and show them that's a pretty much of multitasking feature and below that is the download stuff here you see whatever you have downloaded now here we have other things like settings more tools downloads and stuff and that's amazing so these are the features that I pretty much like about this browser but but there are certain cons this browser is, is still in development I don't think so that they have made many features of a typical browser in these days available and I could say like pinning things and uh, when you just open too many windows they get pinned and it becomes irritating many a times and that's a big con of this browser and there are many stuff like I have opened this Obranion thing and now I can cross it but still it just keeps on pinning it and it fills up my home screen that's a con of it and another con that I would like to say is extensions you don't have any extensions like TubeBuddy and stuff which can be really irritating for the users who are daily using those extensions for their beneficials and stuff so that is for the feature of this browser and now I should conclude that this browser is pretty new concept with amazing features but it lacks a lot of things because it is still a uh, new browser and that's why I would rate it 4, four stars out of 5 if I was 
uh, if there was option and that's good browser so if you want to download this browser then i will be leaving down this link in the description and also there's another feature of copying links directly so i will use that feature to leave the link okay so uh okay i think that's it for the video uh, really thanks for watching be sure to like this video give this video a big thumbs up and for the features uh, for the sake of this browser for what i have communicated through you the new features that you would have never seen before in any browser for the sake of those just let's see if we could break 15 likes for this video and also make sure you subscribe for more videos like this also make sure to comment any suggestions you have any more cons you face any pros any benefits of this browser and if you do think that this browser is a bit faster than regular ones anything that you if you want to thanks me that you got a new amazing browser then also be sure to comment down with that being said let's really thanks for watching my name is Anonov and I'm signing out